He doesn't say it for the sake of saying only, but he really has great love for that child because Bap Dada sees wonderful activities or acts of the children. One day they say to Baba, Baba, you're so sweet, you're so sweet, you are everything for me. I don't know what in what words to express my love for you. You are my only world, you're the only one who belongs to me. So they speak such sweet words and then after two or two, four hours, if something comes in their way, then the, then the ghost comes. So it's not that circumstance comes. But a ghost comes. And Baba Zaming words, path is some like circumstance and bhut is ghost. So Baba has the photo of all of you. Your photo in which you are under the influence of a ghost. As well as the other photo. You know in Bhakti there is a temple of Shiva, uh, the name of which is Bhutnath, the lord of the ghosts. So Shiva is also remembered as the lord of the ghosts. And uh, Baba, Baba watches your game, how the ghost comes and you try to drive it away. Some get so frightened and then get disheartened after that. And and then Bab Dada uh, feels that now this child has become unconscious and someone should go to him and awaken him, make him smell the herb so that he awakens. But then they are so unconscious that they don't even become aware that someone has come to awaken them. So don't be like that. Don't become completely unconscious. Keep some consciousness in you at least. Because if you have some consciousness at least, then you will be saved.